Guys, Vern here, Pokeboy Productions. Today we're going to try out a uh, pop-up. I saw this on my Facebook feed and uh, they coined it fast food, plant-based, plant-based fast food or something like that. Well anyway, it's healthy eating. So if you think it's chicken, it tastes like chicken, but it's plant-based. So we got that going for us. And you probably know me as the guy that likes to eat and we do love to eat, but sometimes we have to settle down and try to eat healthy so so yeah we're gonna give it a try I think they have several chicken sandwiches on the menu and um, yeah you'll see it on the screen somewhere so yeah let's get going and check this out This is your mango and this is the Nashville. Sounds good. <laughs> and you're also here for only today? Only today. I'm with them. I travel with them from Los Angeles. Oh, wow. Okay, so I'm here you guys should come back because I just learned about it today. Oh, really? We're yeah. just seeing it on Facebook? Yeah. <laughs> oh, cool. So here are the orders. I even went and got the Oreo cheesecake to support local, you know. They're only there for one day, too bad. They said they're going to fly back to Los Angeles. I wish they could have uh, stayed longer. But you know, we'll see. Let's see how the fake chicken tastes like. I'm sure it's okay. I mean, they said they've been eating it since they been serving it. So it shouldn't be too bad. And you probably saw the pictures. Hopefully it does itself justice that what you, get, what you see is what you get, right? <laughs> so we'll see how it tastes. So we'll be right back. Okay, so we just finished eating some really good, believe it or not, plant-based food. Now, if you didn't tell me that was chicken and you had me blindfolded in the corner or something, I would have never, I couldn't tell, to tell you the truth. If you looked at the chicken that you were eating, looked at it closely, it actually does look like it. You know, the texture just, just tasted like chicken. I mean, it's fake chicken, but it tasted you know what they say everything tastes like chicken <laughs> you gotta you gotta believe that saying so we got the mango abanero chicken sandwich as well as the nashville chicken sandwich my sister-in-law and i decided to split my sandwich and her sandwich in half so that way we could have a taste of both worlds so the nashville chicken sandwich 15 dollars comes with the bun crispy patty dipped in cayenne sauce pickles and creamy coleslaw and then the other one is the mango abanero chicken sandwich that's also crispy patty dipped in mango habanero sauce with some ranch, lettuce, and some jalapenos. They were both really pretty good. Both tasted like chicken sandwiches. The mango habanero had a little bit of kick to it. The jalapenos especially made it a little bit more spicier, but it was oozing with juicy mango habanero sauce. And yeah, tasted like the real thing. I gotta tell you. The Nashville chicken itself was also pretty good. Had a coleslaw or some kind of substitute coleslaw and gave it a little bit of a sweet kick and uh, yeah it tasted just as good and I would highly both recommend those sandwiches I also tried the french fries it was just pretty good and the ranch sauce also was made another soy based product I know it wasn't made from mayo so she's gonna try to replicate it for her next barbecue see how that goes but it's pretty good I would highly recommend both any of those items in that menu we also got the Oreo cheesecake don't know what kind of cheese they, they used if they're not using dairy might be some kind of soy based product or soy milk I'm not sure uh, my sister-in-law tasted it and said she could tell the difference between a real cheesecake but didn't take any way, anything away from the taste still tasted sweet as hell and I tried it and you know what still tasted like an Oreo cheesecake to me 
got the little Oreo crumbles in it and I would also highly recommend them and I believe they sold all kinds of cheesecakes there too bad I didn't have a big stomach to try them all um, we, all, all in all I think we were all impressed by it the food definitely is not cheap and like I said they were only there for one day I spoke to the people that were running it and they said they they were on a tour throughout the states and New Jersey was the last stop they were heading back to California and you know California always gets all the fancy food right so that's where they started and I asked them to come back because plant-based junk food I think has potential so I mean it's not for everyone and it's not gonna replace my real chicken or beef or pork but I, I wouldn't mind eating it again um, but yeah it's definitely an expensive taste so make sure you guys have money and it's, it's true what they say the healthier you get the, the more expensive it does get and I saved a, a few calories today you know my on my weight loss goal but I promise to keep eating for you guys <laughs> so keep watching me and the boys will keep eating anyway if you like that video don't forget to like comment subscribe ring the bell and subscribe if you haven't did I say that and share it if you haven't yet ding 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 see you guys later